I'm Hannah Wilmarth, senior writer at Fantini Research, and I'm here with Incredible, Incredible Technologies Director of Product Management, Sean Cassid. Thank you, and welcome to the Incredible Technologies booth here at G2E 2022. At IT, we are very proud to be known in the industry to have a spirit and culture of innovation. It's not always easy creating a, uh, you know, a new, innovative, first-of-its-kind product. There's always an inherent risk, and especially over recent times. Last year, we were able to show our Prism BXP cabinet with its large, physically moving portrait display. And this year, we're able to show how we leverage all the capabilities of that cabinet along with our Flex Edge displays to create a whole bank integrated product unlike any other. In a moment, Kelsey will take you through and show you our Prism VXP Elite package and our new game family with Dragon Rush. Over the last year, we've expanded into several product verticals and into new markets. In international markets, we are pleased to hold the number two ranking in the recent Fantini Research uh, EMEA Game Performance Reports released last month. And for new product verticals, we have uh, gone live in Kentucky with our historical horse racing. We are testing our electronic table games at several casinos across the US, and we've expanded significantly in our class two markets. With all of the growth that we've had in class two, it is very fitting that our industry first and first of its kind product that we're showing this year is in that space of class two. I can think of no one better than Russ Witt to show that product to you in just a few minutes. And without further ado, I'll turn it over to Kelsey Sullivan, our manager of product marketing to show you Dragon Rush. And now we'll hear from marketing manager Kelsey Sullivan. Thank you. Hello everybody, it's great to be back at G2E and in full force, it's great to see everybody's faces. Uh, last year we launched the Prism VXP cabinet which is behind me. This is the first core cabinet to integrate physical movement into gameplay and we are still so proud of this incredible piece of hardware. We are bringing it with the full force in all of its glory with the Prism Elite package. The Elite package incorporates the same cabinet, the Prism VXP, which stands for vertical expansion because the screen actually does rise for gameplay and now attract mode. When the entire bank is cashed out, the bank will actually initiate a wave feature. So as the games go up and down, it attracts players are walking by because they've never seen a slot machine that actually moves before. So they may sit down, come try it out, and actually get this thing to go off and hit a bonus where the game will actually move once again. So behind me and launching on the Elite package is Dragon Rush. We have Fei Nu and Fei Jin. This software incorporates mechanical movement more than any of our previous games, which have a unique bonus mechanic for the physical movement feature. We have Power Push, which has a coin pusher feature. We have Multi Ball with a pachinko style. So we're using the mechanical movement in different bonuses in different ways to attract all types of players. So in Dragon Rush, we have this incredible dragon flying across the entire bank. We've got the wave feature going, and it really is quite a spectacle. And it looks amazing on walls or in a football shape that we have here today. So we're going to get started. We are looking for six scatters to trigger a bonus feature. So we are lucky and ran, landed those on our first spin. So the screen rises for the bonus. And now we are spinning to collect as much money as we can on those reels. Like a popular hold and spin feature, with every scatter that lands, the count is reset back up to three. We're looking to fill the screen for an extra $100 at our 60 cent bet. And we're also looking for wheel scatters to get into this progressive wheel. Players who may want to toggle between credits and dollars amount can do so by tapping on the cash and that actually changes the amounts up here as well. Those prizes will change with your bet. Every spin, we're trying to land one more, and sometimes our dragon will actually help players out. If we've run out of spins, he can give us another three or throw down another scatter. For most of our character games, if there's a character above, they're helping out players to make them feel like they have somebody on their side and that wants them to win. Two more spins are bonus here. Let's see if we can fill the screen for an extra $100. Last spin, and our dragon has said, not done yet, and added another three spins for this bonus feature. And we got an egg from up top with all of our prizes. Spinning for that last spot, see if we're lucky. Last spin, oh my gosh, we got another three. 
I've seen this happen in person. This game is out on floors. I think I've seen it four times in a row, so the Dragon can keep the anticipation rolling and keep players excited to play. So we finally finished our bonus feature. The monitor will actually move back down and wait in place for the next bonus. So as we do our count up, it's up high for everybody to see and create that excitement on the game because this cabinet is great up close. The graphics are incredible. It's 4K. But this mechanical feature is for everybody behind you because it's really hard to see when you're up close, but it really does attract players and patrons walking by behind on the casino floor. So we're lowering back into place. Okay, so we've upped our bed and now we're gonna check out free spins. We just need three of these scatters to land on the reels. They're displayed up in the top so players know what they're looking for. Slam. So with three scatters, once again, the screen rises and we start our free spins. Now in this iteration of Dragon Rush, we have more of our top symbol and wilds added to the reels. In Phase Gen, there's actually a multiplier feature within free spins. So it's a little bit of a variation for players who may prefer one or the other. Of course, during free spins, we can still trigger our bonus. We already have one golden egg locked on the reels. That's actually a wheel. So we're hoping to land the other five to get into that bonus. One more spin, we got another egg from the dragon. One more gold spin. And the dragon gave us more gold spins, so if we had used up those Golden, golden spins, the eggs actually would have moved back up to the top and collected in the pile waiting to be triggered on the next bonus. So as more and more eggs collect, the pile grows. So players walking by may see one that's a little bit higher and maybe more inclined to play that one because it's going to look like a bigger and better bonus. So we finished our free spins, but we still got three gold spins remaining. Let's see if we can do anything with those. The screen has moved back down since we've concluded our free spins. Let's wrap up our gold spins here. We just keep getting those gold spins. So as they land on top of each other, you might notice them moving around. So if another scatter would land behind it, it's not going to block or deter players from getting that second one. So there was our last spin. And so the eggs have moved back up into this pile. It just grows and grows, and it will reset after the bonus trigger is featured. So Dragon Rush is actually available now. It is out live on casino floors, and we're very excited to see it expand across the country. And now, Director of Central Determinate Gaming, Russell Witt. Hi, thank you. Um, so I'm Russell Witt. I'm the Director of Central Determinant Gaming for Incredible Technologies. And I'm proud to show you uh, the centerpiece of our show this year. It's the industry's first uh, Class II uh, electronic table game. So we call this True Pick Bingo. Uh, and basically what this is is very similar to what you would play in like a live call uh, bingo hall. So the bingo blower is replaced by the actual physical RNG, which is the roulette wheel. Um, we're playing 38 ball bingo, so it's a single, single ball, single, single pattern win. Um, and then basically when you come over to the actual electronic player interface, we're allowing the patron to actually participate in the creation of their bingo card. So all of the 192 plus bet permutations and roulette are available on here. So all the patron is really doing is going ahead and helping in the creation of their bingo card. So if they bet on a straight number, that number would populate onto their bingo card and the other 24 spaces would be randomized by the bingo session manager. So a direct bet, uh, a corner bet, the edges, um, the, any of the rows, odd evens, all those are represented by single bingo cards. Uh, then the actual bets would stop. After that was done, the wheel's gonna spin, it's gonna drop into one of those pockets, and if that's the winner of the interim pattern, then the player will win. They can actually go and search all of their previous bingo cards back up to 200 currently, uh, and look at the prize pattern IDs that they have. Also, the game ending prize to end the game of bingo uh, is based on a number sequence. So if those numbers come out in sequence uh, and the player has that second number on their card, they're eligible to win the game ending prize.